gaslighting. You know, that dishonest, manipulative thing where one person tries to confuse another person by making them doubt and question reality? Turns out, it's not just for toxic relationships anymore because we have been officially gaslit by natural gas. You know the thing you heat your home and cook with? Natural gas is anything but natural. It's actually methane, a poisonous, toxic fossil fuel that puts our communities, climate, and children at risk. But the fat cats who profit off methane gas have denied that reality for years, telling us it's safe, affordable, and oh so clean. Heck, they even use logos like this to try and sell it. Look at those leaves. So green, so earthy, like it's a spa treatment or something. The thing is, it's all just a marketing trick used to disguise the fact that methane gas is explosive, unhealthy, and destroying the earth. And on top of all of that, it's burning a hole in our wallets. Methane gas has tripled in cost in just the last year, making everything more expensive from heating our homes to cooking. So if you can't afford to heat and eat, you might want to cut back on cooking because stoves leak methane gas even when they're turned off. And some of the chemicals in that nasty gassy have been linked to cancer, cardiovascular disease, and childhood asthma. Just another reality those gaseous execs fail to fill us in on. But hey, look on the bright side. At least your wheezing kids and mounting medical bills will be a nice distraction from the fact that methane gas is a big cause of global warming which makes it worse for the climate than coal. You know that dark sooty fuel, also known as Santa's worst present? Yep, methane gas is worse than that. <laughs> and it's the leading cause of this stuff. So despite all the gaslighting, the fact is methane gas isn't good for your wallet, your health, or the earth. It's not natural and it isn't going to give you a facial. We have been lied to, pure and simple. And it's about time we did something about it. To learn more, go to gasleaks.org.